Hello, class. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Hello, guys. How are you? Very good, teacher. Very good. Okay, so that's great. We're going to start, guys. Welcome. Hi, Sarita. Hello, Marlene. Hello, Janet. Uh, Roberto. Hi, Karen. Hello. Uh, Selena, welcome. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, everybody. Good evening, Roberto. Good evening, Neftali. Hello. Good evening, teacher. Hello, good evening, guys. Let me see who else is over here. Uh, good evening, I make... Hello, good evening. Hello. Good evening. Let me see who else is here. Hi, Wendy. Hello. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, Wendy. Okay. Oscar Santana. Okay, he's a listener today. He mentioned something. Okay, guys. Uh, well, we're going to start with our session for today's uh, lesson, which is basically about um, while well, we continue with some activities related to, um, well, some topics previously discussed. And look at this. Um, here we have let me see, our lesson objective for this class. So this is about, um, in this class, you'll learn vocabulary for describing feelings in gestures. Okay, so that's our main uh, objective for this class. So I'm gonna start showing you some pictures. So you uh, you can select any of these um, numbers, right? So you decide and you, you have to tell me what are they probably thinking about or what this uh, expression means? Let's see. So let's start. Um, yeah. Can you see the numbers? Yeah. Tell me. Yes, teacher. Okay, perfect. So let's see. Can you select one number, please? Anybody? Uh, seven. Seven. Okay. So what is this person saying using nonverbal communication? What do you think? So what is she saying? <laughs> Tired and boring, I think. Tired, boring, um, yeah, okay. Anybody else who wants to share? What is she saying? So what does she mean with that? Disgusting. Yeah, she's kind of tired, yeah, you know, yeah. Okay, let's see, let's check. Oh, so we have another action. Yeah, probably annoyed, right? So you're annoyed because of what someone did. Let's see, can you select any other number, guys? Numbers? Big one. Four. Four, okay, let's see, number four. <laughs> okay, so what does his face mean? So what is this person saying using number by communication? <laughs> it's a sleepy. <laughs> He's sleeping. <laughs> okay. Anybody else? Sleepy. What else? What else could be that? Anything like, else? Like a dummy. <laughs> you oh, look yeah. like a dummy. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I think so. Too. <laughs> okay. Okay. Uh, we have one possibility on board. Okay. Let's see. Pick another number. 13. 13. Okay, let's see. 13. Okay. How about this one? So, uh, I don't know. Have you done that before? So, what, what do we mean with that expression? What do you think? So, what is this person saying? So imagine how important is body language. So what do we mean with that? So have you ever done this? Yes, no. Let me see. We have some more participants. 
So what do you think? So you can type your answer as well. Marlene, what do you think, Marlene? Roberto, Sarita, uh, Jenny, what do you think? Disgusting. Disgusting? Yes? Is that what you said? Okay, so no, disgusting. It could be. Yeah, it could be. Okay, so can you pick another number, guys? Select a number, please. Nine. Number nine, okay. Um, no, okay, so what is this person saying, guys? Any idea? Look at Confusing. Me. Confusing, yes. Yeah, something might be confusing. Yes, you're right. She's confused. I'm confused now. Okay, let's see. Pick another number. Anybody? Number one. Number one, okay. So what is the baby <laughs> expressing? Yeah, scary. Scary. Scary? Yeah, okay. He's scary. Yeah, maybe. Let's see. Okay, so that's when you are, yeah, maybe when you're surprised, right, of something or scared, right? Okay, let's see. Uh, number, please. Ten. Ten. Okay, let's see. Number ten. So what is Spider-Man saying with that expression? I, I, well, that's not a Spider-Man, right? Deadpool. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. Surprising. Surprising. Surprise. Okay. So he's showing some surprise. So he's shocked. Shocked. Uh -huh, he's shocked. Okay. Cool. Another number, guys. Number three. Three. Okay. Three. Number three. What? Oh, okay. So. Uh. Well, since we're the same team, I guess I'm just let's see. I'll pick a number. You still have some numbers. Pick one. Number two. Number two. Oh, okay, reset score. Yeah, no points. Let me see another number. Number eight. Six. Oh. six. Okay, six. Okay, so what is he saying? What do you think? So when you do this, <laughs> when do you do this, guys? It's boring. boring. Like when something is boring? Okay. It's stressful. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, when someone's crazy, no, okay, yeah, maybe I, I don't really think so, but maybe it could be okay. So, bored at night, yeah, I'm bored at night. Maybe uh, somebody's talking too much, right? Okay, let's see. Uh, please pick a number. Select any number. So, tell me. Number A. A. Okay. Hmm. So when you do this face, <laughs> I don't know. Why do you laugh? Have you ever done that? Ya lo han hecho. So what is she saying with that expression? How do you think she feels? Any idea? What do you think? Jenny, what do you think about here? I don't know, maybe critica, <laughs> no sé. Um confused. She's confused. Maybe. You sure? Okay, so let's see. I'm gonna show it. Okay, yeah, she's annoyed actually. She's annoyed because of someone. Annoyed. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because we normally do that when we're annoyed, right? 
when we're angry it's with someone mm. or when someone is saying something that we don't like <laughs> i won't do it <laughs> okay let's see uh select a number team one uh well we all uh, are the same team select a number 11 11 okay so let's see so what is disagree uh -huh. disagree 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 what else disagree disagreement okay so let's see let's see what do we have for this i'm not interested yeah it could be disagreement yes okay. another number guys Twelve. Twelve. Okay, let's see. <laughs> okay, so what do you think? Happy. He's handsome. I uh, know. What do you say? Happy. Happy. <laughs> <Yes>. Okay. <laughs> I thought you were saying he's handsome, teacher. Okay. <laughs> okay, yeah. Amazing, teacher. Amazing. Amazing. Amazing, <laughs> he's listening, he's happy. <laughs> okay, that was a good one. Okay, select another number. Five. Five. Ah, okay. Maybe next time we're going to play in teams. Okay, number? Fifteen. Fifteen, okay. So what is the boss saying about you guys? <laughs> what do you think? Annoyed. Annoyed, yeah. Maybe the supervisor is annoying or bored. Yeah, I would say that he's like angry, right? With someone. But that's possible. Um, 14 or 16? 16. Okay. So what is she saying? Confused. Confused. Okay. I'm confused. I don't get it. Okay. And the last one? So what does she express with that face? Mm, maybe disagree. Disagreement? Uh-huh. Maybe she's not interested. Sorry. She's bored. Um, yeah, annoyed. She shows some disagreement. Okay. Yeah. So good job. So it's a tie. Uh, let's see. So now we're going to continue with our book and we're gonna be checking so that's uh so that's what it means so this is let me see okay that was page 83 so i'm gonna start sharing the book with you Let's give me a couple of seconds. Okay, so here we have it. So that's what it means, uh, body language. So that's what we're uh, checking today. So look at the first one. Leave me alone. That's finished. I'm thinking, I don't know, I'm bored. So these are some common body language expressions that we sometimes do, right? When we we want to show some feelings, right? Yeah. Um, so we have some questions over here. So do people in your country use these gestures? What do you think? Do we use it, Jenny? Question number uh one. <clears throat> do you people in your country use this? Uh, yes. In yes. my in my job. Uh, <laughs> okay, I'll work. Yeah. Uh, 
when when the people is um angry mm -hmm. i i give give you some to eat <laughs> okay so have you done any of these gestures do you use them do you use that kind of body language and uh, yes, the people uh, in in my my work is so stressful because uh, we work with kids. Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah, I think so. Yeah, mm -hmm. uh, the expression is the first in the picture. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Interesting. Yeah. Interesting. Yeah. Uh, well. Um. Yeah, I'm thinking. I'm all. I'm, I'm most of the time thinking. <laughs> Let's see. How about? Okay, thanks, Jenny. Good, good. Um, Roberto, how about you, Roberto? So, um, do you uh do people in your work use this kind of gestures or do you use them? Uh, maybe the third one. I the use it. One. I use it. I'm thinking. Okay. Uh, um, do you know any other gesture to communicate these meanings? Uh, my mother, when she's mad at me, she told me oh, anytime, okay. leave me alone or something like that. Something like that. Okay. Uh, uh, do uh, you use any other gesture? Uh, I know gesture. Um, Maybe when you're happy, angry, or when you're sad, do you use any any kind of gesture with your uh, body, and what does it mean? Um, maybe uh, sometimes I, I feel uh, I don't know if you say it's stress. Mm -hmm. uh, when when my work when I, I I don't do good my work or or uh, I feel stress. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yes. Okay, got it. Roberto, good. Let me see. We have some more. Uh maybe um Michelle. Michelle, how about you, Michelle? So the people in your work or in your house do this kind of gestures. Let's see. Okay, Marlene, Marlene. So what do you think? So, do you use this kind of gestures or somebody that you know? I don't know the chair. Mm -hmm. And how about you? Do you use any kind of body mm -hmm. language when you're angry, when you're thoughtful, when you're <laughs> sad or happy? When I am, when I'm angry because all the day I with my older son and so you because, what do you, because he hasn't washed the dishes I don't know, dish. <laughs> he hasn't maybe done his homework yes. uh -huh. you don't you don't want you don't want to do anything no, and, okay. and because I'm good. angry all the day <laughs> my gosh okay yeah i understand that part <laughs> yeah yeah that's <laughs> difficult yeah but uh-huh so that's it's important right body language because we well we don't we never know right how we can may feel others right <laughs> what some people can can feel when we do this okay but but that's nice um and how about your job so have you seen somebody doing any kind of gesture any kind of, uh, let's say, uh, message that they want to share with, with us, with their body. So, for example, when you say something, when you point something, uh, look at that lady, for example. Mm -hmm. So, do you know, uh, Areli, Areli, so do you know any other gesture that you sometimes uh, use or somebody else? Any other gesture? That you know? And I'm confused. Ah, when you're confused. When you're confused. Okay. And happiness. 
Ah, okay, when you want to show happiness. Okay, thanks. So we're gonna continue talking about it. Just let me scroll down. Oh, okay, so I'm gonna play the here, it's here. Look at this. So I'm gonna show you the video with some of the expressions that we have seen and some of the vocabulary, okay? So let's say, let's play that. Hi, are you ready to begin? I want you to take a look at the following images and listen to the following expressions. Remember to play the audio program and repeat it as many times as you need to. He's biting his nails. He's rolling his eyes. He's scratching his head. He's tapping his foot. He's twirling his hair. He's wrinkling his nose. Now I want you to use the previous expressions with these adjectives to describe how the man is feeling. Annoyed, bored, confused, frustrated, impatient. Hi, are you ready to begin? Okay, sorry, I want you to take a look at the following images and listen to the following expressions. Remember to play the audio program and repeat it as many times as you need to. He's biting his nails. He's rolling his eyes. He's scratching his head. He's tapping his foot. He's turning his hair. He's wrinkling his nose. Okay, so we're gonna be checking some of the, uh, some other feelings and gestures that we sometimes do when we want to show some feelings. Um, look at this, what is this man doing in each picture? So we have to match the expressions with the picture and then compare, um, right? So number one, so what is the gesture? Picture, letter, we have uh, five pictures, A, B, C, D, and E, and well, and F. So we have six. So number one, what do you think? What is the picture letter? He's biting his nails. Letter D. Letter D. Letter D. Yes. Oh, it's, uh, D. Okay. So do you use that? Do you do you do that uh, kind of uh, gesture? So have you done that? He's nervous. Yeah. So when do you do it? When you're nervous. Okay. Good point. Nice. Okay. So let me see what happened. He's doing. Okay. Yeah, we sometimes when we're about to, let's say, to take an exam or something, in, where, where we're about to do something important, right? Um, okay, number two, he's rolling his eyes. What do we mean with rolling uh, rolling our eyes? C. Letter C. 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 Letter C. Okay, let me see. Letter C. Yeah, that's C. I guess I will use it. But that's C. Okay, so how about let me see. Um okay, so when you do that gesture, when do you do it? So when do you roll your eyes? Could be when you're thinking someone you are thinking. When you're thinking about someone? No, no, or only only thinking. Thinking. When, for for example, when when you someone don't remember. <laughs> you don't remember. <laughs> okay. When someone is uh, ask ask you some some question, and you roll your eyes because you are thinking in this in this moment could be. <laughs> yeah, I have seen this that you do that. Well, I have seen this, and probably I have done it. <laughs> For when, example, teacher, uh -huh. when I have disagreed, the opinion, mm, okay, on a different thing. Uh huh. Yeah, yeah. Maybe when you're thinking about uh, a different opinion, right? So when you disagree with someone, yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. So how about number three? He's scratching his head. Letter F. 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 
F. And what this what does it mean? So what do we mean with scratching our head? When I, I think I understand <laughs> something, <laughs> for example. He don't know anything. <laughs> I don't know anything. Oh, when he don't don't know about something. Uh huh. When he doesn't know about something, yes. Yeah, maybe. When I I'm when concerned. I don't have idea. <laughs> okay, when you don't have idea. Okay, so maybe you're trying to get some help from your head. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Yes, uh, I think we have one more opinion. Yeah? No? Okay, let's see. Number four. He's tapping his foot. He's tapping his foot. E. E. Letter E. Letter E. Do e. you see? Oh, yes. So when do you do uh when do you do this? When it, someone is impatient. Impatient. No. Okay, when someone is impatient. What else? When I have a stressful. Mm -hmm. When you're under stress, okay. Maybe you're waiting for someone, yeah. Okay, uh, let's see. Uh, the next one, number five, he's twirling his hair. What do you think? What's twirling? A letter A. Letter? A. 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 Okay, that's A. So when do you do this? That's A. Mm, when I... So twirling is uh, like girando, dándole vueltas, like doing this with your hair, right? So, uh-huh. When do you do that? When I'm confused. When you're confused? Okay. What else? Maybe when you are nervous. When, when you feel boring. When boring. You feel bored. Okay, so do you do this when you're bored? Yes. Okay. So I was thinking about a different idea, like mm -hmm. when you're nervous, right? When you're nervous, you tend to do this, right? <laughs> okay and the last one he's uh, wrinkling his nose when i don't like something <laughs> oh wow well that would be really i don't know okay so when you don't like something like you're, you're wrinkling your 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 nose arrugando ahí su, su nariz Okay, so when you don't like something, when you're, what else? What else could it be? Irritated. When you feel irritated. Okay. Yeah, it might be. Okay, so now we're going to use these pictures in order to uh, provide a description. For example, we have uh, the pictures and these adjectives to describe how the man is feeling. Annoyed, bored confused, disgusted, embarrassed, exhausted, frustrated, impatient, irritated, and nervous. So how will you do this? In this first picture, um, in the first picture, he's turning, he's here, he looks nervous. How about in the second picture? Okay. In the second picture, so what do you think? He looks frustrated. Okay. He looks frustrated. Okay. About the next one. Letter C. Letter C. Picture three. He looks confused. He looks confused. So he's, so could you add a gesture? He's confused. He's uh, oh. rolling. He's rolling his eyes. Eyes. Uh -huh. He looks confused. Okay, he looks confused. Okay, so how about the next one? Letter uh, D, letter D. 
picture D. Mm, the picture D. He looks he's, nervous. He's nervous? He, he's what nervous. is he doing? He, his name. He's, uh -huh. he's being nervous. Okay. He's nervous. Okay. Confused. Nervous. 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 Really? So he's confused. Yeah, he's confused. He's, uh, let's say, uh, he's shocked, maybe. Okay, so how about uh, picture E? It's number five. This one. Picture E, he's, look. he's taping his phone. He's look impatient. Impatient. He looks impatient. So he's tapping his foot. He's tapping his foot. So do you do that? Yes, do you do that? Um, probably when you're maybe. thinking, when you're waiting, when you're expecting. He's look, maybe he's look uh, irritated. He's look um, yeah, he may be irritated. Okay. Yeah, but I agree with you. He's impatient. Okay, and for the last one, in this picture, he's confused. He's confused. What right, is he doing? Right. Or embarrassed. He's scratching. He's scratching. He's scratching his head. head. He's ah, okay. uh, confused. confused. He looks confused. Okay, good. Let's see. So we have some more activities to do. Wrinkling his hair. He's wrinkling his nose. He's turning his eyes. He's scratching his head times as you need to. His okay, so I'm going to play the audio so you can listen to the, the correct pronunciation of the gestures and feelings. Biting his nails. He's rolling his eyes. He's scratching his head. He's tapping his foot. He's turning his hair. He's wrinkling his nose. Okay, so now we do it once together. He's beating his nails. He's bedding. Uh -huh. his, his nails. He's rolling his eyes. He's rolling his eyes. He's scratching his head. He's scratching his, scratching his head. head. His head. His. His head. His okay. head. He's tapping his foot. He's tapping his foot. He's, tapping his foot. Foot. He's turning his hair. He's turning his hair. His hair. He's turning his hair. His hair. He's wrinkling his nose. He's drinking his nose. Wrinkling. 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 Wrinkling his nose. Arrugando. Arrugando ahí su nariz. He's turning his hair. Turning. 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 Oh. He's curling his hair. He's curling his hair. He's tapping his foot. He's tapping his, his foot. He's scratching his head. He's, He's scratching his, his head. head. His head. He's rolling his eyes. He's, He's rolling, rolling his, his eyes. eyes. He's beating his nails. He's beating his, his nails. nails. Okay, let's continue. Teacher, what is the pronunciation in picture number, perdón, what is the pronunciation in number six? He's wrinkling. 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 Uh-huh. He's wrinkling. He's no. Wrinkling. Wrinkling. Thank you, teacher. Okay. Teacher. Here. Hi. Number one is biting or beating. Oh, okay. So let me play that again. Right. Okay. Times as you need to. He's biting his nails. Oh yeah, you, you're right. He's biting, biting, okay. biting. Yeah, biting. He's biting his nails. He's rolling his eyes. He's scratching his head. He's tapping his foot. He's turning his hair and he's wrinkling his nose. Okay. He's rolling his eyes. He's scratching his head. He's tapping his foot. He's turning his hair. He's wrinkling his nose. Now I want you to use the previous expressions with these adjectives to describe how the man is feeling. Annoyed, 
bored, confused, frustrated, impatient. Okay, so now uh, I needed to write a short example describing how the man is feeling. So remember, you can use the expressions. Did you take notes of the expressions? So you can use these expressions besides the adjectives. Uh, for example, number one, um, adjective one, annoyed, bored, confused, frustrated, and impatient. For example, he's, uh, okay, impatient, he's tapping, his food. So try to write one example through the chat. Okay. So try to write one example. So you you may modify that as well, because we have done that. So write one example through the chat, through the chat, okay? Mm, okay, thanks, Sarah. He's rolling his eyes, he looks confused. Okay, let's see. Um, volunteer, volunteer. So give us your example. Okay, Jenny. She's frustrated. She's rolling the ace. Mm -hmm. Okay. She's frustrated. Okay. She's rolling her eyes. Okay. Nice. Another example. Somebody else. So you can modify that. So you can talk about somebody else. For example, my boss is. So what will you say about your boss? My boss is confused, for example. He is. So what will you say about your boss? My boss is confused. He's So what could be um, an expression that you could use? So I'm gonna show you the expressions back again, okay? So maybe you you can pray your sentences easily. Look at this. Okay, so here you have it. My boss is confused. He's confused. 
he's scratching his head. Scratching his head, okay. Let me see. My mother, okay, my mother is, so could you give me an expression, a gesture? My mother is, okay, biting her nails. She looks? She looks nervous. Nervous, okay. Okay, let's see. My co-worker, let's talk about co-workers. My co-worker is, uh, let me see. Fairly. Tapping. Okay, tapping again, tapping. Fair his foot. His foot, okay, tapping his foot. He looks, he looks disgusted. Eh, disgusted. 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 Okay. disgusted. Impatient. Okay, disgusted. Impatient. Angry. Yeah, angry. Okay, let's see. Let's talk about somebody else. Uh, my neighbor. Okay, my neighbor. So my neighbor is uh, rolling uh, her eyes. She looks. Disagree. 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 No, maybe bored. Maybe bored. May, bo uh -huh, maybe angry. Maybe annoyed. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Look at this. Um, you have annoyed, bored, confused, disgusted, embarrassed, exhausted, frustrated, irritated. She looks, I think she look irritated, right? Irritated. Okay, so talk to me about, okay, my, let me see. Uh -huh, talk to me about somebody else that you, that you know. My, my friend. Okay, my friend is, um, let me see. Turling. Turling uh, her hair. She looks. What do you think? My friend is turning his uh, her hair. She looks maybe confused. 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 Nervous. Okay. Okay, my dad is, let me see, so something, um, okay, wrinkling, okay, wrinkling, okay, my dad is wrinkling, uh, his nose, he looks, guys, so what do you think? I don't know. Mm -hmm. Annoyed, confused, embarrassed, exhausted. He's First, confused. He's yeah. confused. Mm, confused? Uh, wrinkling his nose? Confused uh, or uh, nervous? Uh, mm -hmm. Nervous. Disagree? Uh, maybe, um, yeah. Disagree. It looks disagree. Is he look or frustrated? Ah, okay. Frustrated, yeah. Uh -huh. So I'll say so. He looks frustrated. Okay. Let's see. Um okay. Okay. My sister is scratching her uh, hair. Uh, her head. It looks so. Try to use another adjective. So we have embarrassed, exhausted, frustrated. So what will you um do when you scratch your head? 
So what were you at, guys? Annoyed, confused, embarrassed, frustrated, irritated. My sister is scratching her head. She looks nervous. Nervous. Confused. Nervous, confused, embarrassed. Okay. Okay, not embarrassed. Okay, perfect, guys. So now we continue with the next part of the activity. Uh, you may take some notes. I'm going to send you the examples. He's threatening his hair. He's wrinkling his nose. Now I want you to use the previous expressions with these adjectives to describe how the man is. Okay, so now we'll continue with the second part of our lesson objective. And in this part, you'll learn about, well, we have been talking about body language. And we're going to be um, practicing a conversation just for the last uh, few minutes. Okay. Hi, welcome back. Listen to the following conversation and pay attention to the use of models and adverbs as they speak. Remember, you may practice the conversation with a friend or a classmate. After the conversation, you will listen to the explanation. Have you met Raj? Part A. Listen and practice. Have you met Raj, the student from India? No, I haven't. Well, he seems really nice, but there's one thing I noticed. He moves his head from side to side when you talk to him. You know, like this. Maybe it means he doesn't understand you. No, I don't think so. Or it could mean he doesn't agree with you. Actually, people from India sometimes move their heads from side to side when they agree with you. Oh, so that's what it means. Hi, welcome back. Listen to the following conversation and pay attention to the use of models and adverbs as they speak. Remember, you may practice the conversation with a friend or a classmate. After the conversation, you will listen to the explanation. Have you met Raj? Part A. Listen and practice. Have you met Raj, the student from India? No, I haven't. Well, he seems really nice, but there's one thing I noticed. He moves his head from side to side when you talk to him. You know, like this. Maybe it means he doesn't understand you. No, I don't think so. Or it could mean he doesn't agree with you. Actually, people from India sometimes move their heads from side to side when they agree with you. Oh, so that's what it means. Noticed. He moves his head from... Okay, so we're going to be practicing the conversation um, and, and in our next class, we're going to be checking a little bit more about these uh, models and adverbs. Let's see, volunteers. We need uh, Ron, Emily, and Peter. So we need three volunteers. Let's see. Me, teacher. Okay, so we got Me, one. Teacher. Jenny, Marlene, and uh, Karen, okay? So go ahead, ladies. How do you meet Ra, the student from India? No, I no, haven't. I haven't. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Marlene, you can be Emily and uh, you run. Uh, let's see. I am wrong. Okay. <laughs> okay. Again. Again, please. Jenny, otra vez. How do you meet Ra, the student from India? No, I haven't. Well, he Where? seems. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's see. Jenny, you're Ron. Emily, who's Emily? Yes. Emily? Me, teacher Marlene. Okay, Marlene and um, Peter. Peter I once. Uh -huh. I am part. I am here. Okay. <laughs> Up here, okay. Let's start. Again, again, Jenny. Again. Hmm. 
How do you meet Ra? The student from India? No, I haven't. Well, he seemed really nice, but there's one thing I noticed. He moved his head from side to side when you talk to him. You know, you know, like he like this. Maybe it means he doesn't understand you. No, I don't think so. Or it could mean he doesn't agree with you. Peter? Got it. Actually, people from India sometimes move their head from side to side when they agree with, with you. Oh, so that's what I it means. Okay, thanks, ladies. Uh, Kara, you continue with Ron. Let's see. Look at this. Um, okay. Actually, people from India sometimes move, move their move. heads. Uh -huh, move their move. heads there. Their heads. Their heads. Their heads from their side heads. to side uh, when they agree with you. Oh, so that's what it means. Okay, let's see. We continue with Karen. Let's see. Um, volunteers. Okay. Elisa, Areli. Okay, Areli. Thanks, Areli. And let me see. Maybe Giselle. Okay, Giselle. Okay, Giselle, I am wrong. Okay. Have, have you met Rai, the student from India? No, I haven't. Well, he seemed really nice, but there's one thing I noticed he's moving his head from side to side. When you talk to him, you not like this? Maybe it means he doesn't understand you. Understand no, you. no, I don't think so. Or or it call me he doesn't agree with you. Peter. Wendy. Actually, people from India sometimes move their hand from side to side when they agree with you. Oh, so that what it mean? Mm -hmm. Okay, so that's what it means. Uh, let's try to repeat the conversation together. So have you met Raj? So have you met Raj? And he said something like that, right? So have you met Ra, the student from India? No, I haven't. Well, he seems really nice. Well, he seems really nice. But there is one thing I notice. He moves his head from side to side when you talk to him. You know like this maybe it means he doesn't understand you no i don't think so or it could mean he doesn't agree with you actually people from india sometimes move their heads from side to side when they agree with you oh so that's what it means oh so that's what it means so that's what it means so that's what it means oh so that's what it means Okay, let's see, Wendy, we continue with you, Wendy, and let me see, uh, Edgar, you hear uh, Edgar, you hear? From city. Mm -hmm. I'm just looking for somebody else, um, Jose, okay, Jose, Jose, and let me see, yes. okay, um, Maria Santos. I am wrong. Okay. Have you met Rob, the student from India? No, I haven't. Well, he seems really nice, but there's one thing I noticed. He moved his head from side to side when you talk to him. You know, like this. Maybe 
maybe it means he doesn't understand you. Oh, I don't see, see so. Or it could mean he doesn't agree with you. Actually, people from India sometimes move their heads from side to side when they agree with you. Oh, so that's what it means. So that's that's what it means. That's what it means. Okay. What that mean? mm -hmm. That's what it means. Oh, so that's what it means? That's, that's, that's. Okay. So that... Sorry, my apologies. <laughs> let's see. Um. Okay, maybe Sarita, Elisa, and Roberto, and um, Neftali. Guys? Roberto, Sarah, ah. Elisa? Uh-huh. Okay, I am Ron. Okay. Okay, I'm going to start. How do you mean Raj, the student from India? No, I haven't. Well, he seemed really nice, but there is one thing I noticed. He moved his head from side to side when you talk to him. You know, like this. Maybe it's, it means he doesn't understand you. No, I don't think so. Or it could mean he doesn't agree with you. Actually, people from India sometimes move their head from side to side when they agree with you. Oh, so that's what it means. Okay, thanks you. Thank you, guys. Let's see. Um, we continue with uh, let me see, Neftali, Wendy, and uh, Selma. Okay. How do you mean Raj, the student from India? Okay, let's see. I need... Um... No, I haven't. Okay. Well, he seemed really nice. But there's a one, one thing I noticed. He moved his head from side to side when you talk to him. You know, like this. Maybe it means he doesn't understand you. No, I, I don't think so. Or it could mean he doesn't agree with you. Who is Let's Peter? Continue, Natalie. Okay, actually, okay, people we from... have Wendy. Sorry, we got Wendy. <laughs> Wendy, go ahead. sorry. Actually, people from India sometimes move their heads for side to side when they agree with you. Oh, so that's what I mean. <laughs> okay. Oh, so that's what it means. Okay. Thank you, guys. Uh, we're going to read these together once more, and then we're done, right? I'm going to pass it then at least. Um, have you met Raj, the student from India? No, I haven't. Well, he seems really nice, but there's one thing I noticed. So remember, you have a comma, you have to make a short pause. Well, he seems really nice, but there is one thing I noticed. He moves his head from side to side when you talk to him. You know, like this. Maybe it means he doesn't understand you. No, I don't think so. Or it could be, uh, it could mean he doesn't agree with you. Actually, people from India sometimes move their heads from side to side when they agree with you. Oh, so that's what it means. Okay, guys, Um, we're going to stop in here. I'm going to pass the attendance list in a moment. Just give me a couple of seconds uh, while I look for that, okay? Let's see. Uh, by the way, uh, you have been asked to send some uh, information about your manual, so please try to do that soon, so as soon as possible. Recuerden que se les ha estado solicitando eh, compartir el, el manual, solamente les piden ahí que compartan la primera página, me parece. Envíen los datos ahí que les, que les hacen falta. También estaban haciendo la solicitud para algunas personas eh, para el próximo nivel. Ya estamos a punto de terminar. Entonces, hace como unos días antes. 
que están pendientes ahí de, de enviar todo, todo con tiempo. Ok, so let me see. Ok, Edgar Fernando Portillo Cabrera. Elisa Arely López Campos. Present teacher. Arely, Giselle María Hernández Torres. Janet. Present. Janet Carolina Rivera. Present teacher. José Lino Alvarenga. Present teacher. Karen Elizabeth Bernal. Present teacher. Karen Ivette Villanueva. María Santos López López. Marlene Elizabeth Valle Barahona. Present teacher. Thanks. Michelle Beatriz Díaz Guzmán. Present teacher. Thanks. Neftali Antonio Santos, Mejía. Santos, she said, present in the chat, teacher. Okay. Present teacher. I'm Neftali. Okay, Neftali. Thanks. Oscar Alexander Santana. Present teacher. Thanks. Roberto Eduardo Escamilla. Present teacher. Thanks, Roberto. Sara Elisa Belloso. Present. Thanks. Selma Yamilet Peña Flores. Present. Thanks. And Wendy Cecilia Molina Rosales. Present teacher. Thanks. And Jenny Carolina Ardón Cruz. Present teacher. Okay. Thank you guys for being here today. I'll see you in our next class tomorrow. Okay. So have a good night, guys. Bye bye. 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 Good, good night. night. Bye bye, guys. Take care.